Hey guys, what's up? This is guy Today, making a new video comparing the Insurgent versus the APC. So before I get into this video, I want to say thank you to you guys who subscribe to this channel. We at 900 subscribers. I cannot believe this. I got nearly 70 subscribers in a week. That's the best I ever done on YouTube. I usually don't get that in two months and I got that in a week. Thank you so much guys. Now without the way, let's get right into this video. So first off, we're gonna drag race these two vehicles. I think you already know which one gonna win, but we're gonna see results right here. So first off, the APC get a good start and then at the end of the race, the insurgent beat it by a far off distance. I mean, it be about very far off distance. Now, when this race ends, let's get to the next thing. So now what we doing, we testing out the pushing power. So sadly, we couldn't do it in the front bumper cause the APC got too good at parking angles on it where it just run over the insurgent. So we had to do it backwards. And you can see the results right here, what's going on. The APC is badly pushing it, but you could tell it's a little bit more stronger. It got more traction and cause it weight more that's why it's pushing the, the insurgent with no problem so now what we doing we testing out the armor so first off we're going to test out the apc it could survive seven rpgs and then on the eighth rpg it blows it up now i'm going to let you watch this as I test the RPGs on the APC, then we're going to move to the insurgent. So now we're testing the insurgent. You're going to be surprised, but this thing could survive 7 RPGs also. And it destroys on the 8 RPG just like the APC. But you gotta realize the APC has much smaller windows. So that make it more harder to get shot out the APC than the insurgent. Now after I finish this, I'm gonna show you the next thing. So now I'm showing you the price of these vehicles. So first off, let's start the APC. The APC is $3,092,250 and the discount price is $2,325,000. Now the insurgent, it is $897,000 and the discount price is $675,000. That's after you done the humane lab raid heist. Now let's get to the next thing. So now I'm gonna set the unique features of one vehicle that the other one do not have. So first off, I'm gonna start with the APC. First off, it could drive in the ocean like a boat. Second off, when you first buy the APC, it comes with the same cannon as the Rhino tank and it could be upgraded to a SAM missile system and you could upgrade it to have unlimited proximity mines. Now, I'm gonna tell you about the insurgent. The insurgent, it could hold up to six people and it's way cheaper and it's much faster than the APC. Now, that's the unique features. Tell me what you think about the unique features, which one you refer to me. The insurgent is way cheaper, so first off, I, I will buy the A. I mean, I will buy the insurgent before I get the APC. So that is my opinion. If you don't have that much money, get the insurgent, don't get the APC so fast. And don't forget, you need two people to get the full potential of the APC. Because you need a driver and then you need somebody to operate the cannon or the sound missile system. 
So to me that's a big screw up that Rockstar actually made this a two people vehicle where you need somebody to operate the guns for you to me it's just so so stupid by Rockstar. In GTA 4 the APC wasn't like that. In GTA 4 you could drive the APC and control the cannon. Don't ask me why in GTA 5 they, they decide to skew this vehicle up so bad. It's just so stupid when Rockstar makes stupid mistakes like this. To me they really skewed the APC up. That's why I like the oppressor more than the APC in this update. To me they just really just skewed the APC up. So tell me what you think about this comparison in this video. Tell me which one you prefer to buy and which one did you buy. So without the way, make sure to subscribe, leave a like, and leave a comment in the comment section stating your opinion on this video and tell me stuff that I have to improve on cause I'm a small YouTuber and I'm trying to do my best to grow my YouTube channel and hopefully it does grow and do good. So make sure to subscribe, leave a comment, and I'm out guys. Peace.